Hey guys, Sierra Reaper Hunter here. Welcome back to another video. And today I will be making a Reaper review, a long awaited Reaper review on the Caretaker. So I just ordered this guy off of Spear Halloween's website almost a week ago, and he just came today. And I'm super happy to finally own him because I think he is really awesome. And he is definitely my favorite Spear Halloween 2021 animatronic. So yeah, let's get into the review. Overall, I think he has a really cool appearance. He's definitely a really cool looking prop. He's just got a typical dark gray cloak. It's kind of like a thicker material, like on the top of his cloak, and then the bottom of his cloak is more of a thin fabric. Um, he has a really cool face too. He has a latex face. He's got a bunch of like rips and crevices in his skin. He has like a zombified looking face. His mouth is cool looking too. He's got like these rotting teeth. And he has similar eyes to Hugs and Towering Clown, those kind of SVI eyes. But he is an SVI. He's made by New Ray's son, which I think is definitely really interesting because he looks a lot like an SVI prop. But he is New Ray's son, which is definitely really cool, especially to see that they're coming back as well. And they also made Krampus and Two Scoops. Here's his shovel. It's got a pretty good amount of detail on it. It's really cool looking. It's got all these like little cracks and stuff in it. It's got some designs on the corners. And a design going up the shovel and then there's a little baphomet or goat head on the shovel which is definitely cool and it's just plastic same with the rest of the shovel is also plastic it definitely does look really cool and the shovel is really cool probably one of the cooler parts on him same with his face at first i didn't like his face i wish he had a skull face at first but his face has definitely grown on me i think it's definitely really cool looking and it's very detailed too. On the sides, it even has a little bit of detail, which is definitely really cool. It's definitely a really good face sculpt. And here's his box. Oh yeah, by the way, on his hands, he has black fingernails, which is really interesting because on at the flagship store, the model at flagship didn't have them and the one in the video doesn't have them either. So I think that's definitely really cool to see that he has black fingernails. Here's his box. I think it's definitely a really cool looking box. Here's the side, has some other side views of him. And then here's the back of the box, which has his little story on it. And then his tombstone on the back, on his back, has actually some designs on it too, which is definitely really cool. It's got a skull on it. And then it says, rest in peace, 1806 to 1863. I think it's definitely really cool that they added a design on the back of the shovel, or not the shovel, the back of the tombstone, because you don't really see the back of them. But I think it's definitely really cool looking. He also is kind of like hunched over, like the tombstone is weighing him down, which I think is definitely really cool too. So yeah, I will do a demo of him. Let me just plug him in. And then I will do... A demo. So here he is. There you are. I've been looking for you all night. <laughs> I've come for you in regards to a serious matter. A very grave matter. <laughs> there is no escape. No one will hear your cries for help. The earth will fill your lungs as you try to scream. Buried alive! <laughs> Take a good look at my face. It will be the last thing you ever see, right before I seal your coffin for your eternal slumber. Sweet dreams. <laughs> So yeah, overall, I think he's definitely a really awesome prop. Definitely my favorite animatronic of the year. I do rate him a 5 out of 5 because there's nothing really wrong with him at all. I think he's definitely really awesome. 
He has a very awesome appearance. I love the tombstone on his back. It's definitely really cool. I love how it has the skull on it and stuff. And his tombs, or not his tombstone, his shovel is also really cool to looking too. I love the designs in it. And his face and his hands, just his overall appearance, all of his appearance is definitely really cool. So yeah, without further ado, I will see you guys in the next video. And look out for more spooky videos.